What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Dr. Drippy, back in the banger. And today I got a new clip for you guys. Today I got how to get any color body umber in GTA 5 online. So without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Alright, so the first thing you guys gonna need to do is you guys gonna need to register the CEO. And then once you register the CEO, you guys are going to need to request in your MOC. So we're on the services or the MOC and then request your MOC. Alright guys, so the reason why we need our MOC is because it's a certain type of body armor that we need that you only get from doing this certain type of MOC mission that I'm about to tell you guys in a few minutes. And this body armor is going to help us out to get the color body armor that we want. So also, if you guys don't know where your house is on the map, what you guys can do is you guys can open up your map and then set a point of interest by pressing Y if you're on Xbox next to your house. That way, it'll be easier for you to uh, find your house when we go inside the mission. So once you guys have that, what you're gonna do next is go ahead and head inside of your MOC. All right guys, so once you guys get inside of your MOC, what you wanna do is head straight back to that little computer icon on the screen, then sign in to the computer, then scroll down to the very bottom so you see the mission called Work Dispute. If you guys don't have this mission unlocked, you guys will have to do all the other missions before that to unlock the mission Work Dispute. Also, you guys have to be the host of this job to get the black body armor that we need. If you guys do on a friend, you guys won't get the black body armor, you get the red body armor, and we don't need that right here. So, you guys have to be the host. Also, put the difficulty to easy, that way you guys don't get, uh, you guys don't get shot at as soon as the mission starts up. And also, you guys will need a friend for this, so go ahead and invite, you, uh, invite a friend. And then once he joins, go ahead and start the mission up. So I'll see you guys once we get inside of the mission. All right, guys. So once you guys get inside the mission, what you want to do from here is go ahead and fly up the plane. And then once you guys fly up the plane, you guys want to fly over to your apartment. And if you guys forgot where your apartment was, all you have to do is open up your map and see where you put your point of entrance at and then fly over there. So I'll see you guys once I get over to my apartment. All right, guys. So once you guys make it to your apartment, what you want to do is go walk up to the little blue circle right there. And it should say that you guys can't access your apartment. Once you guys see that message right there, what you want to do is put any explosive out, put inside a little blue circle, and you guys want to blow yourself up. Once you guys blow yourself up, and then you respawn, it shows that you guys go inside your apartment this time. So I'm running back over to my apartment, and as you guys can see, it lets me go inside this time. So I'll see you guys once I make it up to my apartment. All right guys, so once you guys make it inside of your apartment, what you guys wanna do now is you guys wanna either head upstairs or downstairs depending on which apartment you're inside of. And then once you make it to your closet, you guys wanna go ahead and save this as an outfit. I'm in a stick right here. I said to save it in slot one and name it C1. All you are gonna do is save it in slot two and name it C2. And then once you guys do that, all you wanna do now is you guys wanna go ahead and open up your phone and go ahead and quit the mission. So I'll see you guys once I get back inside of a free mode. All right, guys. So once you guys load back inside of free mode, you guys won't be wearing the outfit that we just saved. So what you guys want to do is you guys want to head over to the clothes store, and then you guys want to quit the outfit that we just saved. So I'll tell you guys what made it the clothes store. All right, guys. So once you guys get back to the clothes store, and you put the outfit that we just saved in top of the mission, what we're gonna do next is. We're gonna take off our jacket and take off our top. What you're gonna do is head off the tops, go to suit jackets, and then take off your jacket. Then scroll down till you see t-shirts and then take off your t-shirt. So once you guys do those two things right there, what you're gonna do is you guys are gonna open up your, your interaction menu. And then once you do that, go to inventory or the body armor and then choose which body armor you guys want. For me, I'm gonna choose the heavy armor because it gives you the purple body armor. I'll leave a list in the description to which body armor gives you which color body armor. And then once you guys do that, what you wanna do is go ahead and save this in slot one and then name it C1. You guys have to name it C1, but it, uh, I, I name it that to make it easier for me. So once you guys do this stuff right here, now we're gonna start the two console methods this glitch right here. So you guys will need two consoles or a trusted friend that has your account on the Xbox or, I mean, and, and you guys gonna need this program called NetCut. I'll leave a link in the description to download NetCut. And then once you guys have those two things, 
you guys wanna open up your interaction menu, go to parachute, and then you guys wanna equip the Israel parachute. And you guys should get a game save. If you guys did not get a game save like me, all they wanna do is do the same thing, so take the parachute off and then put it back on. And you guys should get a game save right here. And then once you get the game save, all you wanna do is open up that cut and you guys want to lag your connection. So if you guys don't know how to do that, I'll show you guys what I'm talking about right here. All right, guys. So once you guys download and open the net cut, you do stuff like this right here. What you guys gonna do from here is you guys gonna scroll down the list and do to your console name. If you guys do not see your console name on the list right here, what you are gonna do is go back to console number one, the console that you were just on. Go to your network settings and then figure out what your console IP address is. Once you guys figure out what your console IP address is, come back to NetCut and then go to that little blue search bar up there and then type in your console IP address and then press enter. And then once you press enter, your console is gonna pop up on you guys screen. And then that's how you know that that's your console right there. And then go ahead and name it. If you're on Xbox, name it Xbox. If you're on PS4, just name it PS4 just in case you guys wanna do this again. It, um, it's already saved on here. So once you guys do that, you guys are gonna click on that little blue Wi-Fi icon. You guys gonna click on that, and it should turn red. And once it turns red, that's how you know you guys connection is cut on you guys console. And then once it's cut, if you're on Xbox, what you gonna do is you gotta wait five minutes, and then after five minutes, you're gonna go to console number two. So I see you guys once we get on console number two. All right, guys. So once you guys make it to console number two, what you gonna do is load the save file. And if you guys get to alert right here, all you want to do is click on sync last save data. And then once you click on sync last save data, all you want to do from there is go ahead and load straight to story mode. So I see you guys once we get to story mode. Alright guys, so once you guys load into start story mode on console number two, what you guys gonna do next is you guys are gonna press the pause button. Go to online, play teaching online, and make an invite on session. So I see you guys once you load into the invite on session. Alright guys, so once you guys load inside the invite only session, what you want to do is open up your interaction menu, go to style, switch to the C2 outfit, go to parachute, put the Israel parachute back on, then wait for the game save, then select the story mode character, and then load back inside story mode. So once you guys load the story mode, you guys should be good to go. So once you load the style story mode, you guys are going to quit GTA, and then sign out of your account and head back to console number one. So I see that guys once I get to console number one. All right guys, so once you guys get back to console number one, everything should still be the same. So what you guys are doing here is you guys are going to open up your interaction menu, put a style, parachute, and take off your parachute. And then you guys should get a orange lone circle in the bottom right hand corner. And then it won't go away until we reconnect the internet back to the net cut. So I see that guys once we make it over to net cut. All right, guys, once you guys get the net cut, you guys should notice that the Wi-Fi icon is still red. So all you want to do from here is click on the uh, Wi-Fi icon and it should turn back blue again. And then once it turn back blue, that's how you know that your uh, internet is fully connected back to your console. And that's all you got to do on net cut. So I'll see you guys once we get back over to console number one. All right, as you guys can see that the uh, blood circle went away. But if you guys do have like this little thing where it says like save and fail on your screen, all you want to do is open it your interaction menu, put a style, parachute. You guys want to um, put the parachute. And then once you quit the parachute, you guys want to back up the interaction menu and then take it off and then back out again. And then it should say safe sexual. So then once you guys do that, all you're going to do from here is you guys want to hold down hold down the d-pad and then select the story mode character so i see you guys once we make it the story mode all right guys once you guys make it the story mode what you do now is press the pause button go to online and make an invite on session i'll see you guys once we make it in back to invite on session all right guys so then once you guys load back into the invite on session you guys should notice that the black body armor turned into the purple body armor so now that we got the purple body armor all you want to do now is go to either your house or a, a little clothing store and go ahead and save this as an outfit. It don't matter where you save it, just go ahead and save this as a uh, normal outfit. Well, that's it for today's video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, go ahead and smash that like button. If you're new here and your first time visiting my channel, go ahead and smash the subscribe button. 
and turn on post notifications. So, so whenever I post a video, you gotta get your notifications saying I post a video. Okay, so guys, the next banger, and I'm out.